I want to talk today, my friend, about following the Christ. You would not believe how many times in my long ministry that I've heard people say, you know, when Jesus comes back, I tell you right now, I will follow him. Well, I say you need to follow the Christ today. Jesus' last name was not the Christ. It's what indwelled him. It was his spirit. And he said, it indwells you, Christ in you, your hope of glory. You need to follow something higher than human mind. You need to follow something higher than human sight. You need to follow something higher than human doubt. You need to follow the Christ. The Christ is the very best of you and then raised by a whole lot above even what you can now believe. It is the possible in your life, not the impossible. To know that with God coming through you, thinking as you, acting as you, living as you, that you can do things that you could not dream of in human mind. That you can make a difference with your life. And isn't that why you're here? If you ever asked the question, why am I here? Have you ever wondered, what is this all about? Why am I doing this or that? Why am I wasting my time doing this or that? Live higher. Follow the Christ. Don't wait until some far off time. Follow the Christ right now. And that is something that I ask you to be your prayer today and continuously. Dear God, help me to follow the Christ. A simple prayer, but life-changing. New ideas will come to you. Ideas higher than your human mind. What does that mean? Well, the Bible says to follow the wisdom from above. Where, where is the above? It's above human thinking, my friend. It is above what your mind can conceive. You follow the Christ. You realize that life is not just doing the same thing that you did yesterday. Life is reinvention. Life is thinking in new ways, doing new things. If you tried to do something over and over again that hasn't worked, oh, that's a sign that you're following the wrong way. You're following memory instead of future. You need to follow the Christ to the wisdom from above. You need to follow the Christ to vistas not yet dreamed of, to visions that you cannot yet see, and yet keep walking because God is walking with you by your side, making every day a possibility.